The situation we face could not be more serious. America Jones! Yeah! I don't have to tell you that. We've inherited an economic crisis as deep and as dire as any since the Great Depression. The fate of millions of mothers, fathers, sisters, and brothers, wives, and husbands depends on what we do here today. I just took a moment uh, to look over the draft. Oh, my God. I don't think the American people yet understand how colossal this legislation is. To delay this any further would lead to consequences that could be horrendous. Look at this bill. This bill has got to be done by tonight. Holding up a bill, theatrical. Did you ever do that when George Bush was president? This bill stinks. The process that's led to this bill stinks. The hope and the change that people voted for in the president has come to doom and gloom. The time for change has come. We have a righteous wind at our backs. If this is the change we all can believe in, America's best days are behind her. If we do not act, we face the potential yes. consequence of a catastrophe. 1,100 pages, not, not one member of this body has read. Not one. You get the argument, well, this is not a stimulus bill, this is a spending bill. What do you think a stimulus is? That's the whole point. We go down, there'll be chaos in this globe. History tells us we've got to be careful. If we do nothing, that is, in my view, a hostile act. Do we need to do something as quickly as possible? Yes. But when we do it too fast around here, that's when we get in trouble. When we meet you halfway, don't give us the back of your hand. What happened to the promise that we're going to let the American people see what's in this bill for 48 hours? But nope, we don't have time to do that. Given the um, millions of jobs lost, uh, the recession in this country and in the world, this is the right thing to do. We are too often met with this response. We won, and therefore we're going to do it our way. As president, I expect to be judged and should be judged by the results of this program.